Hi, I'm Michaela. I'm going to take you through around about a four minute warm up that you should be doing before every exercise. We're going to start by just walking on the spot. We're going to get our entire body warm by the end of this warm up, but we're going to take it slowly. We're not going to jump straight into it. So moving a little bit faster, moving your upper body, making sure that your shoulders are back, nice and tall, belly's on. Not in, sucked in, just on. Our core is always on. Lifting your knees a little bit higher now, one at a time. This is going to go really quickly. Raising our heart rate, bring your knees as high as you can, place them down, remember that this is your pace. A little bit higher. Still using your arms. All right, now we're going to come down, placing your feet a little wider than hip width apart, toes slightly pointed outwards. It's important that when we sit down, we don't have our knees tracking over our toes. So push your bottom all the way back and engage it as you rise up. So try not to rely on your quads. Engaging your glutes and coming up. Let's do eight more. Keep going. From the side, I show you pushing your bottom back, shoulders are still back. A few more. We're going to continue going. Three, four. Back to walking. Should have warmed up a little more there. Let's Raise opposite foot to hand. Up, up. Now it's up to you. You can just kick outwards. We're just going to warm up our hips. Place your feet down firmly on the floor. And remember, go at your pace. Don't go as fast as me if you do not feel comfortable. Let's keep going. A few more seconds. We're already more than halfway through our workout. Four more. Lots of breaths. Now come back down to that squat. Take your feet a little bit wider. Elbows to knees, reaching up. Eight of these. Six. Four. Two. And one. Now I'm going to get you to come down. Squat back. Feet about hip width apart. Shoulders are back. And we're going to move from side to side. Two at a time. Fantastic. I'm warming up, hope you are too. Lots of breaths. You should be feeling it in your lower body. Make sure that your core is switched on. Now I'd like you to come to a runner. So we're moving a little bit faster than before. A few seconds here. Well done. As fast as you want to go. Now the butt kickers. Some of my favorites. Place your hands on the lower part of your back. We are going to kick back all the way to the glute as far as you can. I like to take my feet a little wider. So it's a V if you like. Now you may start like this and stay here or Come with me and go a little bit faster. A few more breaths. Four, three, two, one. Now open up those hips. Nice balancing act here. Slight bend to that front leg. Stabilize. Five, six. Now you may hold on to something like a chair or a wall. Other side. Eight. Oh, balance is not as good on this side. Keep going. Four, three, two, and one. Give me some nice big wide arms. Forwards. And back. You're about to get started on your walk workout. Keep walking. Choose a workout that you feel like doing and get started. Let's go.